Let me get back to my questions here. Let's see what we have here. And if you guys happen to be viewing me, have any questions whatsoever, I will do my best to answer them. Let me see here. I'm just reading through additional questions here. And let me switch my screen here. Okay, here's a, I don't know if I can answer this one actually. Let me see here. It says, Hi, could you please advise me? I'm an international student from India. I am taking my master's course in cybersecurity in the UK. Does university matter? And will I be able to get a job once I complete my master's? Please let me know if you can suggest some universities for cybersecurity. Okay, I'm going to answer this one to the best of my ability. So I can only speak for the US and I can tell you the US companies, this is how they behave. And I think that some other countries such as Australia, Canada, and UK follow the same thing. You, for IT, okay, I, I'm not speaking for – if you're a doctor, <laughs> university really matters. If you're a lawyer in the US, university really matters if you're a lawyer. If you're a high-level business exec, university really matters. Here's where it doesn't matter as much. If you start your own company, a degree itself doesn't even matter. <laughs> if you start your own company, a degree doesn't matter. I'm being completely honest and serious. L Richard Branson, I think he dropped out of high school. Like, it doesn't matter if you started, a, but that's not your question. So, your question is Does a degree matter if you're in cybersecurity? And in the US, I can tell you the university itself does not matter. And let me explain to you. I mean, let me qualify you with with an actual my own personal experience i have a degree from a university of phoenix okay university of phoenix is one of the laughing stock of the united states of america <laughs> it's an accredited college it's not like a fake degree or something i really did work to get it it was very expensive the problem with the university of phoenix is that um they kind of gouge some of their students and it feels like you're paying for a degree. You're paying a large amount. of It's a private university. And so they can charge whatever they want. And then they have this like a loan shark attitude about loans. Um, they put people in a lot of debt. They got a lot of flack here. And people, it's a laughing stock here in the U.S. Like if you say, they make jokes about it. Comedians make jokes about it here in the U.S. If you just merely say the word University of Phoenix, in some cases, people just start laughing because <laughs> it's hilarious. I have a degree from there. I make six figures. I've I've made six figures my last three jobs. I'm doing really, I'm doing okay is, is what I'll tell you. University doesn't matter for cybersecurity. What matters is that you can do the work. Now you do need to have accredited college. Like there, I'm not saying you shouldn't have a degree. Many organizations require at least a bachelor's degree if you're, if you're trying to be a high level a high level person, a high level cybersecurity person, they're usually looking for a degree. There's exceptions like my men some of my mentors did not have a degree, okay? My the smartest per people that I know in this field did not do not have a degree. They taught me. And they, and I came in and I had a two three degrees and I have three four certifications and this person who does not have a degree is teaching me and is the most brilliant person I've ever met. They have a degree now, but I'm just telling you just cuz you have a degree Sometimes you can even get in. Now, granted, those people had a lot of experience and had military background and they had a lot of experience in the military. So in the U.S., that goes a really long way. But normally some of the big companies like Price Waterhouse, I don't know in the U.K. ones, but I can tell you all the big three communications, AT&T, T-Mobile. I don't know about Facebook and Google. But I, I'm not sure about those ones, but um, I could tell you Northrop Grumman, Lockheed Martin. These are multi-billion dollar global security companies. I could tell you Raytheon. Um, these are people who launch things into space. OK, I've worked for some of these companies and I have a bachelor's degree from a laughable university now i personally think the university was good i learned stuff there it was legit it's just not it's not it's it's no harvard yeah, i'll just put it to you that way <laughs> so in the u.s i would say um 
a master's degree is is great is is good to have especially if you're going to become a manager but it's good enough to get a solid degree IT degree from a uh, from an accredited college bachelor's degree in IT or one of the STEM like that science technology engineering m mathematics those are the things that large companies in the US are looking for and I a lot of these companies also have business in UK, by the way, and they hire people from the UK. And several organizations that I work with are people from the UK, from Ireland, from all over the world, all over the world. And they, same thing, they have a bachelor's degree uh, or a master's degree for this or that college. And as long as it's an accredited college, now, of course, if you got it from Stanford or MIT, they're going to throw that around like they're going to it's going to be like a badge of honor. You know what I mean? Like <laughs> it's definitely going to be seen at a higher standard if you went to MIT and you have a master's degree from MIT. That goes a long way in IT. That goes a really long way. Those are the kind of guys that become CEOs very easy or they become high level execs or something like just from saying that that they have that and book of course they have to have the skill set you can't just fake the funk you can't you you have to have the skill set that backs it up but yeah okay let me see if i answer your question you said could you advise me on international study india and i have a i'm taking a master's course in cybersecurity. does a university really matter yeah I, I think i answered it in the u.s i would say Depends on the organization you're going to. I would say ultimately, no, they want to see that you have – they want to see your talent. They want to see what you can do. They want to see your experience. That being said, if you did go to Oxford and you got a master's degree from Oxford, of course, it's going to go a very long way. But if you had a degree from University of Phoenix or whatever, you could still make six figures. I know because I'm currently doing just that. I'm doing pretty good. So – Hope that answers your question. I um, hope that this applies to UK. I'm not absolutely certain. Media Network says, hi, Bruce. How you doing? How you doing? I'm just reading comments. 